What's up, Torn? It's your boy IOB, and we back with another video. So today's video is going to be on. It's, it's going to be on the Wizard King build. The Wizard King build. I'm remaking this video because I had to take down the other video, um, and a lot of other videos. So I'm gonna have to remake a lot of them. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna post four today, and I'm gonna post another four tomorrow. So I think that should equal out to how much videos I had on on the game to help y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and repost those for y'all and put them right back up. Um, but yeah, without further ado, right? So the Wizard King build, I look even better than last time. All right, so listen, look at this. You feel me? <laughs> yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. So look, this is the Wizard King build, right? So what I'm running currently right now is Love by Mana, Ma Mahari, and I'm running Magic, um, World Tree for um for Lee Grimoire. So with the four league grimoire, I get the great tree, which allows me to heal. And also this magic also nerfs you and my clan also nerfs you, you know, which is what a wizard king would need. Like, I don't want to take so much damage, obviously. And I also want to heal myself and be unfair and keep distance because this ability right here has a very short cooldown, very short cooldown. And it increases based off how much mana you have. And currently I'm running 65 um, intelligence, so which increases my magic damage. So if you want to increase the, the roots, if you have World Tree, just put your um, stats into intelligence. And over time, it will get you have more and more. And yeah, it has a very low cooldown. Also, the forest also has a very low cooldown. And this ability right here, you can trap people with it. You know, you can trap people with it. You can trap people with it. They step on it, they trap them. And also the forest also, this, this forest move has a chance to trap them. And that move also has a chance to trap them and it has a chance to debuff them. So now all your attacks are gonna debuff or trap people. And the vortex is the most damaging move currently. So if you can trap somebody and put them into your vortex and, and one them at the same time, you have a high chance of killing them right away. Not even capping. And then the next move is the world tree, the healing. It has a very big radius, so you can fight somebody in the middle of this and you and you'll become basically ten times harder to kill. And it stays a very long time and it replenishes your your mana, if I'm speaking too fast, you know, y'all can comment down below. And in, in my next videos, I'll make it, like, way, way, way. I'll, I'll slow down how fast I speak. But, yeah, this is the Wizard King build. And let, my, and let me know what, um, what y'all build is. And if y'all wanted to see my stats, currently, right now, I'm, I'm running mostly Constitution, Intelligence. I'm running 40, um, what's that, 40? 54 into constitution and intelligence i'm running 65 and then two and two these are for my um equipments and then this is what it looks like i got 623 health i'm level 90 um and i got 868 um mana and if y'all i'm gonna post a video on how to obtain the clovers soon and what the clovers do you know peace catch y'all on the next one um leave a like comment and subscribe of course peace